my channel Bliss of Solitude. This is Ananya or Nuna for the people who don't know me or who are new here. I'm extremely sorry for my choked voice because I have been suffering from medium cough and cold since past 2-3 days so uh, I couldn't um, properly talk even. However, uh, today's condition is better so I, uh, I just started making a video and uh, since June is considered to be a pride month which is uh, dedicated to LGBT community, people belonging to the entire LGBTQ community. I have huge respect for them and I feel not only me, we all should respect them and we all should accept them the way they are because love is love. I mean, it's it's totally my opinion and I think many of you will agree with me that love is love. It doesn't have any proper definition like it, it can't be gender specific or age specific or anything like that because and um, we, we cannot bash anyone based on their sexual orientation or different choices. So I think uh, we just all should accept them and love them. The way they are and uh, today's video is going to be entirely dedicated to the uh, to them ju just because this is a pride month and uh, uh, i have tried to create i will not say that i have created because uh, i i am still a learner as i have said in my previous videos that i have not uh, i have not learned makeup professionally what i do or what i can do is entirely by my um, entire passion by my full of courage and wish to to do something or to experiment with makeup products because i have been a dancer and i had huge huge interest um, in makeup and everything and most importantly i remember when i was younger i used to get a lot of call shows apart from the uh, dance shows that were arranged by my school but in some of the programs or some of the shows i have was not allotted with any makeup artist like uh, or some makeup artists just refused to uh, you know uh, just refused to do my makeup because i was uh, not in their list so it i faced a lot of lot of humiliation and uh, um, a problematic situation during such time so uh, it was kind of a mandate mandatory thing for me to learn makeup at least the basic things of makeup uh, so that i can you know if if in future if i face any such any sort of uh, issues like this that makeup artists are not willing to uh, willing to do my makeup or everything i can create my own makeup or i can create my own look and go on a stage so um, i am still trying to learn i am still a learner and um, and most importantly whatever i have learned or whatever i do on uh, my videos i have learned it from youtube and from many 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 famous beauty bloggers or makeup bloggers so i will always say that i have tried to create or i have uh, i am still trying that this is the main thing so if you want to know how i have achieved this look or uh, how i have created this look you have to keep on watching this video and before jumping into the video please make sure you have subscribed to my channel because it's free to subscribe and and definitely subscribe if you like my content otherwise don't because there's no force if you don't like you don't have to subscribe and most importantly beside the subscribe button there will be a little bell icon so you can hit that too to get notified whenever i am posting any video so without any further ado let's get jump into the video I've come with a bare face as you can see now I am using a green tea toner from good vibes and pressing it to my skin rather than dragging it my entire skin from here and there and then I'm using good vibes rose hip serum for moisturizing my skin because I have a combination skin so using a lot of cream might uh, enhance the amount of sweat on my face after completion of my skincare I'll start my makeup with drawing my eyebrow and here I am using wet and wild eyebrow palette I'll be mentioning the shade name and the product link in the description box uh, you can see how making an eyebrow properly entirely makes your skin, face look different you can see that and here I have done both my eyebrows and for the makeup I'll start 
आई मेकअप टू डे फर्स्ट बिकॉज दिस एज अ लॉर ऑफ कलर्स विल बी यूज टू डे फॉर दिस लुक तो आई थॉट इट्स बेटर टू हैव एनी फॉल आउट ऑन द क्रिएटेड बेस्ट इट्स बेटर टू क्रिएट द आई मेकअप एंड फॉर दैट आई हैव यूज एल्फ कंसीलर दिस द शेड इज यू वे लाइटर दैन माई स्किन टोन बट सिंस आई हैव डिसाइडेड टू क्रिएट अ ब्राइटर लुक सो आई नीड अ प्रॉपर बेस फॉर माई आईज and that is why i have used a lighter shade than my skin tone here i am using sfa colors hated with love eye shadow palette the uh, blue edition the green edition actually for the eye makeup i have taken a yellow shade first and placed it on my crease line after that i have taken a lighter orange shade and blended with the yellow shade and then i have taken a deeper color of orange shade which has a bit red undertone to it and placed it out placed it in my outer corner and further i have decided to create a two third cut crease so i have used swiss beauty concealer and uh, create a crease line properly and then used a green shade and then a blue shade and then the purple shade at the inner corner as you can see and blending it blending them properly so that it can it doesn't keep any harsh lines and i have also drawn the eyeliner off camera because i was having so much itching so i have done it off camera and for the lower lash line i have used the same palette and taken the green shade and further i am using the ny bay the big apple of my eye white kajal to to make my eyes look bigger as you can see it is looking bigger and now i am dusting off the excess product that might have fallen down on my face and now i'm using colorba perfect match primer to uh, you know minimize all my pores and everything to applying the primer i have used foundation from nika all day matte foundation in the shade vanilla as you can see and i have blended it off camera so that the video doesn't get longer for the concealer on my face i have used swiss beauty concealer in the shade 02 sand sable and used and i have applied it on my usual points like forehead chin bridge, bridge of the nose uh, cupid bow and everywhere uh, usually that is applied it for contouring my face i have used sugar the 02 vivid victory contour de force palette yes and for the blush i have used the same palette and taken the pink shade for my blush and i have used it on my app on the apple of my cheeks a bit a little bit on chin and a little bit on nose and i'm i'm setting it with the makeup fixing spray from swiss beauty for the mascara i have used maybelline hyper curl mascara for the highlighter i have used the sugar contour force palette itself as you can see and i am highlighting my cheekbones my nose my chin my cupid bow area and my forehead for lipstick i have used smashbox dry liquid lipsticks the shade is driver seat and for the lip gloss i have used sugar smudge me not liquid lipstick duo kit i don't know the shade name i'll be mentioning it in the description box and this is the absolute final look and you enjoy it absolute final look as you can see and i have tried to skip my eyelash today and uh, because i was having uh, a little bit itching on my eyes and as you can see my eyeliner has also my also is messed up here because i don't know for some unknown reasons ama uh, chokti continuously jol porchilo and i couldn't you know stop it properly so amar mone holo je ami jodi er por eyelash lagate jai and everything so it might get hurt and in my might um, increase the issues so i just skipped eyelashes today I think it's looking good without even eyelashes. This entire makeup look, and uh, if you like the entire look and way the way I have created this, then please like this video and share and subscribe to my channel because it would mean absolute world to me, and it would give me more motivation and more courage to um, you know bring exciting, trending, and new contents. Thank you so much, and keep loving and keep supporting. I'm signing off for today.